Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a game called Ad Infinitum. I seen this going around on the uh, Steam, and I was like, huh, that kind of looks interesting because I'm kind of a... Oh, shit. I'm kind of a nut for uh, games that are based on history or something like that. I need to turn my shit down. All right. So, and another thing, I want to come clean about some shit. If you don't want to hear me rambling on, I'll put a timestamp in the in the bottom if you want to skip this. Uh, where I've been, uh, I haven't been feeling all that great uh, up in my head. So I decided to take a little bit of a mental break. Uh, just get away from everything for a while. Um, I haven't even really been talking to friends. I was just on my own. Um, thinking about a lot of bad shit. So, I'm back now, hoping to make a, hoping to hit the ground with my feet running, and we're gonna get into it, and I'm gonna make, uh, the year 2024 my bitch. So, without further ado, Ed Infinitum. I don't really fuck with horror games all that much, but I do have a surprise for y'all in the future. As soon as I can get a little bit more of a... As soon as things start getting a little bit more smoothed out and everything, and I can figure out a way to use uh, my webcam here. But with all that being said, ad infinitum. I don't do that great with horror games, so here we go. <laughs> Prologue. Alright, sick. Turn this up a little bit. I fucking don't really fuck with horror games because uh, it's just not my kind of game. But I saw it and thought it might be an interesting game to play, and I'm sipping on some chai tea while I'm going at this. All right, let's go. You have done it once. Now you need to do it again. What? <sighs> oh, shit. As far as I know, I play as, like, a German coming home from World War One or something. I'm drawing birds and shit. For months you've cursed your hour spent staring at these tables, now you wish you could stay with them forever. Alright, I didn't understand that. Pick up my pencil. I'm gonna color my bird. Uh oh. What the hell? Morgan Granin? What does that say? Any German viewers? Your diary, you'd never leave it out of your sight. I'd text. Take. I'm gonna take this with me. Because I never leave it out of my sight. Alright, I'm gonna get up. What does that say? Hold on. The letters blur from your eyes. Nevertheless, the little effort you managed to decipher them. All trench stations. Operation Morgan Graven. Is that how I say that? Morgan Graven? Continue. Oh, shit. What is this? He's actually done it. He's given the order to go over the top. You don't know who you're more scared for, yourself or him. I spoke to him. But I don't know if he understood what I was saying. Oh, okay. Interesting. If you radio for help instead of fighting, you'll be ar arrested for desertion. Okay, do I have my rifle? Where's my gun? Looks like someone's been repairing something here. It's a shame if you don't understand all that technical stuff. Yeah, right? Where is my rifle, dog? Oh, here we go. Come on, get ready! Yeah, let's go. 
Unfortunately, I'm playing as the Germans. Whatever. Model 98. A Mon 98 model loaded. Safety off. Right, yeah, take. I'm taking it. Press R to equip. Uh, that's an interesting sight. Alright, cool. Oh, I don't like that. At all. Alright. I want up. First platoon awaiting orders, sir. Oh shit. Hello. Second platoon awaiting orders, sir. Berlin Road. What the hell is going on? Berlin Road. What the fuck is going on? Where am I going? Where am I going? Oh, there we go. Alright, I think I'm going in the right way now. Hello. <laughs> Get out there. Climb the ladder. I'm ahead. We'll show you. Okay. What the fuck? I'm trying to figure everything out. What? What is actually going on, brother? Okay. Those look like my guys. Holy shit! Oh shit, here we go. I'm all fucked up in some barbed wire. Oh, yeah, that's lovely. All right. What do you want me to do? Oh, there's somebody over there. <laughs> All right. <coughs> oh shit, I burped. Really burred. Okay, chapter one. Despair. All right. Interesting. I do not like the fact that I have to click and move my mouse in order to open doors. That that does not seem very 
cash money of the game. No! I want my son back! Oh boy. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna sip my tea. Reminds me I should probably get some more. <gasps> oh shit, lag. Alright. Breathing heavy. Waking up out of a cold sweat. That's just one strike, one spark, that's all it takes. I take those. Seems like a good idea. Oh, what is this? Photo of the military company. Okay. Is there a lamp I can take? Give your brother his dagger back. I'm sorry, Paul. I. Now get out, you hmm. dirty little thief! You're no son of mine. All right. Interesting. The mirror is broken. You can't see your reflection; just a shadow. Ah. Uh, there we go. Dear Paul, here is a copy of the Morse code alphabet I made for you. <laughs> you. Probably know it from school. It's a language all its own, which I now speak fluently. Thankfully, my telegraph shelter is in a safe location. Something that's already saved my life twice. Okay. I'll be on leave again soon. Will I see you this time? Or will it just be mother again? Please, take good care of her. Your brother. Alright. Um. I can't do anything here. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, hello. There's a gun in here. What the fuck? Toy gun, a, w a worn toy gun that has seen its fair share of wars. Oh, okay, can I look down the barrel? All right. What the fuck is breathing? Johannes. What? A model plane I made by myself. Okay. Our future hero, they said he could fly blindfolded. Okay. So what exactly am I doing here? Oh, what is this? Trench whistle, your trench whistle, a son you know only too well. Okay. Oh, can I light the... Nope, can't do that. What? Oh, good God, here we go. I feel worse with every day that passes. <laughs> Please, Mother of Mercy, help me. I can't bear another injection. His okay. father, his society, his poison. He says I am mad. He says the cuckoo is my son. But I know what I know. They've taken everything from me. Okay. My children. My language. Even my name. He threw my Bible on the fire and smashed your statues. But they can never take you away from me, Mother of Mercy. Mother of Sorrows. What? Uh, Alright. I'm really confused. 
It's all locked up tight. Damn, I don't have my gun. I don't like how that turned off. Not a big fan of that. I can't do anything with that. That's all locked. Those are all locked. What the shit? Stop flickering like that. You're making my fucking asshole tight. Matches. Okay. Those are all locked. <laughs> the blue door. Is this one opening? No. Your brother's room is locked, but you sure you saw something. It can't be him, can it? Uh-huh. Installation of elevator. This work will be completed by the end of the week and build in house. Right. Take. Take the cog. An elevator up to the attic must be new. You wonder what's up there. Nothing happened. Right, because the wheel. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. I need to go downstairs. There is a distorted voice mumbling to it. Oh, hell no. Oh, fucking hell no. Oh, the door is already kind of open. Oh, I don't like this one bit. Okay. as cruel as his father. I can speak neither of the war nor of my lost sons. I am not even permitted in their rooms. The rooms of my own sons. I'm not permitted to exist at all. If only I were dead too. Okay. Didn't ask. That was this. Uh, mother, when you were young, she would spend every day in the winter garden until grandfather came to live with you, that is. Okay. A oh, bird. Mechanical bird. Oh, no. I have made a terrible mistake. I will take it. In French. Little sister, how are you? We went to Berlin to visit you, but the maid turned us away. There's an old man shouting in German, but I couldn't understand what he was saying. Did we go to the wrong address? You, why did you never write anymore? Did you get the singing bird? I remember how we used to sing in the square in front of the church and marvel at the little golden birds in the window by Mother and Father's Cafe. <clears throat> Ugh. If things have become unbearable, please come back home to us. You are... How are you, the children faring? Please write. Okay. Interesting. What the hell is this? Dearest mother, when I hear the cannon's thunder, I can no what? longer be angry with father. Instead, I worry for all of you. Mm. Have you heard from Paul at all? He hasn't replied to a single one of my letters. Johannes. Johannes. That's my name. What is this? There's nothing in there. Nothing in there either. What in the hell am I supposed to be doing? Turn that off. I feel like that was bad of me to do. 
I'm a crouch. Don't mind me. Dearest mother, I am glad that you at least survived the cold. Don't mind me. But I know how scarce food has become at home. It would be best if we just surrendered. But I'm sure father doesn't want to hear such talk. Oh, oh boy. He probably thinks that the war will bring him glory and honor. Just like grandfather. Glory and honor perished in the very first winter of this war. <sighs> How we wanted to go to war. <laughs> How foolish we were. Nevertheless, I shall write to father. I am worried about Paul. <laughs> Johannes. 15th of April, 1917. <laughs> Alright. What is this? Packet of salt. Sure. I like salt. What is this? Berlin, December 20th, 1918. Dear Frau, Frau von Schmidt, I have brought you some potatoes. You have always been so kind to me and given me a little extra money, so I am glad to be able to do something for you in return. None of us have had... None of us have very much right now, but I know it must be twice as hard for you. Please take care of yourself. I hope I may return to work again for you soon, perhaps when the winter is over. Your friend, Ursula Bruegel. Okay. Oh, the kind of jazz music is starting. Joy. Uh oh. <laughs> That's a quick save. I don't like it when things quick save, dog. What is this? In my darkest hours, it is only music that saves me. Is there a heart in the world that cannot be softened by it? But when Carl plays that terrible orchestrion and his father's music again, I feel sick. The walls crumble and everything comes crashing down around me. <laughs> It makes me want to die. But I know where he keeps the key. Okay. Collecting hints and documents. When you find documents that are relevant to completing a puzzle, you automatically collect them. You can reread them anytime in your inventory by pressing tab. Other documents remain in the game world. You can reread them by simply interacting with them again. Okay. That's fantastic. Stop autosaving. Matches, I will take. Because matches seem like they are important. What is this? Hope, dear generals, that this orchestron and the march we have sent you will bring a small piece of the battlefield into your home for you and your family to enjoy so that you may always be reminded of both your own countless victories and those of our German forefathers. The orchestron is the machine gun of the musical world and will solve all your problems in one fell swoop. Your view brothers of the Order of the Red Eagle. So this is it, huh? Uh, need a key. Oh, there's something going on. And dear Director General, someone seems to have been playing around with your orchestra and I've found a number of parrots have been deliberately removed. I have found the cylinder and installed it, but there's no sign of the missing cog. Likewise, the music roll, of which you spoke, is nowhere to be found. I have placed the key back into the chest in the entrance hall. We will now proceed with the installation of the elevator. The key is in a chest in the entrance hall. Okay. Am I gonna get chased? I don't fuck with being chased, dog. Oh, look. Another open fucking door. Oh, this must be... I can't fucking see. So 
Oh, there's a chest around here somewhere. Locked. Locked. Okay. Matches. Take those. Newspaper containing a list of casualties. You don't want to read them. A red candle. The sweet scent of the red wax permeates the air. Take. Wait, what? What do I use the candle for? Those are locked. So this is like a puzzle game. Oh my god. Open the door. Okay. I need to go upstairs. It seems. Ooh, that's cool. I like it. I dig it. I dig it. I really do dig it. That's locked. Damn, man. Up oh, key. You may have it. May 25th, 1916. Magdalena refuses to accept that both our sons have now taken up service in the name of the Kaiser and the people. This is madness. <laughs> I never wanted to believe father, but perhaps he was right. Perhaps she cannot be helped. Ever since father came to stay with us nine years ago, she has changed completely. I have administered Quicksilver. After a brief protest, she finally quietened down. Oh, interesting. I'll be right back. All right, let's uh, let's figure this out. Syringe and vial, quicksilver, ten milliliters. Interesting. Is that like a cure for madness or something? People getting pissed off and shit. All right, so I got the key. So I can. Oh wait, there's a candle. There's like candles here. Hold on. I can take the candles. Picture of you and your brother, your gaze is drawn to the obituary alongside it. You fought and they just gave up on you. Nice. I'm gonna take the candles. With the deepest regret, we hereby report that the sons of our director general and grandsons of the great general Lothar von Schmidt, Paul von Schmidt, born 5th of March, 1899. And Johannes von Schmidt. Born 3rd of October. 1893. Have met their heroic deaths on the Western Front. Hmm. May they rest in peace. Berlin. 12th of October. 1917. Karl von Schmidt and Co. Paint Factories. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. <clears throat> so those are locked up. So, wait a minute. The Kaiser called and we all answered with God in our hearts. Okay. My heart fucking balances on the loss of your two sons, your friend, you burgle. Gotcha. Wait a minute. But don't play the fucking snare like that, please. Don't make me want to fucking shit my pants. I feel like these candles are going to come in handy for something. I don't know what, but... Something. Locked. Locked. Question mark. Oh, 
Oh, okay. So here is that. So where did I find the orchestron? It was over here somewhere, if I remember correctly. I just don't know where. Oh, and by the way, I had some Starfield footage, but that corrupted because it's a piece of shit. No, that was not the way up to the orchestron. Where did I find the orchestron? The orchestron, I should say. I feel like I'm about to be, like, molested by a monster. I do not diggity dig this. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> now you're wet too! Stop splashing! Mama, he got water on me and now I'm all wet! Oh, Come no. and sit on the bank with me. Yeah. There you go. Now, put your feet in the water. Nice and warm, isn't it? Warm and wet. <laughs> warm and wet, yay. Red candle, gimme. Look at the sailboats. They're so fast. Mm. Him, when father saw the painting of himself for the first time, he said nothing, not a word. America. From Vanze. The lakes aren't that big. Well, who knows? Maybe they'll find a- Uh-huh. What? In order to treat your wife's pronounced hysteria melancholia, she must be spared of any kind of emotional strain. She must avoid any objects or persons that may trigger an episode. I recommend one injection every two days until her symptoms start to improve. Daily injections are recommended during more severe melancholic phases. <clears throat> Interesting. They could sail down the harbor, then the Elba, and all the way to Hamburg. The gateway no. to the world. Open all the there, way. Anything's possible. The hell is in here? Oh, here we go. Oh, I found it. Alright, cool. Okay, um... The music roll. There we go. I need to turn off the orchestron to place this object. No. Open. Oh. Alright. Okay, I think that's everything. Oh, hell. I don't know if that was good or not. I feel like... Oh, that's, this is bad. I am uncomfortable. A dummy, it almost seems to be watching you. I feel like it is fucking watching me. Our family tree is taking root. A gift from Santa Balbina among Carl's father's exotic plants. A piece of my home. Well, isn't that just dandy? I don't like that thing. I really fucking don't. Something's gonna come out and like, touch my asshole and I'm not gonna be fucking happy about it. You staring at me, motherfucker? Stop. 
You better fucking stop. What is this? While Kong was away, Herr Dupre and I made use of the time to take a tour of the house. He didn't want to see the cuckoo. He believes me. When we entered the zone, oh. he said he felt an icy chill right where the old tyrant died. He brought nothing but misfortune upon us, even when he was still alive. All right, calm down. Dupre says that the house attracts many angry souls. He says I should use charms, spirit bells, and knocking three times for the Trinity to try and ward them off until our next session. The angels will aid me in this. I want to believe him, but the awful cuckoo knocks too oh. and calls out and wants to eat constantly. It is driving me out of my mind. Okay. Um. Cool, I guess. What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh no! This time I felt him. It was as if my Johannes was standing next to me, placing his hand on my shoulder. Herr Dupre was right. With each session we are drawing closer, I can feel it. There has been a spate okay. of strange coincidences. It is a sign. I have been working on the dummy again. I'm trying to fill it with life so that Johannes will accept it and finally return to me. Oh, are you doing some like weird witchcraft shit? Bitch, what? A phonograph. There's no wax cylinder inside. There's no wax cylinder. I have wax candles. That thing is gonna come to fucking life. And like. Touch my asshole. I'm not gonna be fucking happy about it. Okay, so I have to find something to... Mold the wax? What is this? Hmm... Oh, chores list. Okay. Um... Okay. So I need to figure out a way to... Nothing happened. So I have to find a way... To make a wax cylinder? I don't like that. You wonder what's up there? Yeah, I do wonder what's up there. Way up the attic is a repulsive, a propulsive stench assaults your nostrils. How do I get up there? Because up there is probably how I make a wax cylinder. Okay. Well, let's. Look around down here, I guess. There's got to be a way to make a wax cylinder. Somehow, someway. I'm almost out of time. For today. How do I make a wax cylinder? Oh, I didn't, like, I didn't look at this thing. What is this? A strange pendulum, you wonder what it could be for. It's cause... Your mom is into like some weird seance shit. And wants to like... But I have... A wax cylinder. <laughs> Objective, someone rang the front doorbell. Okay. Oh boy. This is where I get jump scared. Okay! What the fuck? Dear Frau Van Schmidt, 
Due to all your unpaid bills and your husband threats of physical violence against my person, I regret to inform you that I will not be able to guide you through your spiritual session in person today. However, knowing how desperately you need the aid of the angelic powers in these dark times, I am enclosing a wax cylinder with my instructions and the invocation of Angeloi. In addition to this, please find enclosed silver candlestick holders and in consecrated pendulum which reacts sensitively to spiritual vibrations particularly those of an evil nature should still be in your possession from my last visit i have taken the liberty of adding the cost for these items to your last outstanding payment with you in spirit and dupri okay the wax cylinder i will take candlestick holders Five lead candlestick holders. The silver paint is already starting to flake off. Okay. Play the recording on the wax cylinder. I don't fuck with this. This is my ball, and don't you forget it. I just wanted to play with it. <laughs> Get your own. But mine isn't red. You stubborn little so-and-so. All right then. But make sure you bring it back. Promise. I promise. Okay. Play the recording on the wax cylinder. I don't... Know what you mean by that? Hey, stop pushing! It's not okay. my fault you're such a slowpoke, and it's not my fault you can't do a boost up right. <laughs> I've told you to no climbing in through the window, but you didn't open the door. I knocked for ages, and no one answered. <laughs> oh, boys, come on in then, but keep the noise down. Your grandfather's sleeping. Oh, sweet God, here we go. According to the letter from the, sp the spirit of the pendulum is sensitive to spiritual vibrations. Right. I don't want to play that thing just yet. I feel like the candlesticks. Okay, fuck it, here we go. Follow my words to the letter in order to ensure the success of your spiritual session in my absence. Oh boy. Pause the playback of my voice on the wax turned after each step until you have correctly completed the step in question. Okay. Begin by placing the five silver candlestick holders I sent you on the table. Naturally, these have been blessed. Oh, it stopped. Okay. Man, I don't know how this shit... Do you have the candles and the matches? Oh. Place the candles in the candlestick holders. Okay. Man, I don't know how I feel about this. This is some, like, weird shit. Yeah, I've got salt. The consecrated pendulum will now show you the order in which you need to mark out the lines of the witch's foot between the candles. Use the pendulum, then mark out the lines with the salt. Once you have done this, we can proceed further. Oh, this is some like, uh, this is weird. I don't like it. I really don't like this.
Yeah, this is... Yeah, nah, dude. Okay. This is legitimately summoning a demon, brother. That's what happens. This fucking thing is gonna get up and start chasing me around, and I'm not gonna be fucking digging it. Very good. Now, find the personal item that belonged to the deceased. I... You could try to play ball. We have had some success with it in the past. Oh, I already picked it up. I don't like it. I don't like this. I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, anger, Lord, I am spirits of the will. I really do not like this. Of the, Lord. the wisdom of the old moon is with you. I don't like it. What the fuck are you talking about? Find among them the soul of the child. Find it and lead it to its mother. <clears throat> lead it through the light and into our circle. I... <sighs> are you good? Is here. The child is here. That is not a fucking child. I don't want to see the shadow. Do not let it deceive you. What the hell? I don't like it. Can I have a gun? Is it though? I see. Oh, red. You must never use red to candles. Do you hear me, Frau von Schmidt? Never red. What? Oh boy, here we go. Yeah, I fucking knew it. I sense a presence with It is not the Virgin Mary. It is her Luciferian counterpart. Mortar. Dolorosa. The mother of sorrow. 
Yeah. Yeah, I fucking knew it. I don't like it. Am I able to save? Am I able to save because I am... I am out of time. I don't know. I, don't, I do not dig this. Oh, hell no. What, what the fuck do you want me to do? <laughs> Follow the wet tracks. Ah, yes. Where are the wet tracks? What the hell? Yeah, sure, I'll follow the wet tracks. Yeah, sure. Wait, that's the telephone. It stopped. I don't like it. Oh, fuck no. Nah. Hello? Dude. Not into this shit. Uh, oh, I am not into this. Hello? Ball? I can have it? Yeah, this is some- yep, yep, I fucking knew it. Fuck all of that. Ruins. Right. <laughs> Dude. I don't know how I feel about this, Doug. Okay. What the fuck? Get me the hell out of there. Okay, well, I'm going to try and... Um... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna, like, save and quit in quotations here. <clears throat> this is definitely interesting. Not a whole lot of scary thing has happened but uh yeah i'm i'm kind of digging this game already so yeah let me know if you want to see more i plan on playing more and uploading it so i'll catch you guys on the flip side peace out